Hey everyone, your favorite girl is back with part two of Lizzo who is being sued by three of her former dancers. Yes, they have filed a lawsuit against Lizzo accusing the singer of sexual harassment and creating a hostile work environment. The dancers were allegedly weight shamed and pressured while at a strip club. Now this is a shocker to everyone okay Lizzo has social media in a frenzy right now after she is being accused of these horrible allegations okay so Lizzo did come forward and she came out with a message and this is what she had to say it says these last few days have been gut-wrenching difficult and overwhelming disappointing my work ethics morals and respectfulness have been questioned my character has been criticized usually I choose not to respond to false allegations but these are as unbelievable as they sound and too outrageous to not be addressed these sensationalized stories are coming from former employees who have already publicly admitted that they were told their behavior on tour was inappropriate and unprofessional now how are you gonna say they unprofessional and you allegedly took them to a new club without them knowing a mess okay and then it goes on to say as an artist I have always been very passionate about what I do I take my music and my performance seriously because at the end of the day I only want to put out the best art that represent me and my fans with passion comes hard work and high standards sometimes I have to make hard decisions but it's never my intentions to make anyone feel uncomfortable or like they aren't valued as an important part of the team she goes on to say I am not here to be looked at as a victim but also also know that I am not the villain that people in the media have portrayed me to be these last few days. I am very open with my sexuality and expressing myself but I cannot accept or allow people to use that openness to make me out to be something I am not. There is nothing I take more seriously than the respect we deserve as women in the world. I know what it feels like to be body shamed on a daily basis and would absolutely never criticize or terminate an employee because of their weight all right she says I'm hurt but I will not let the good work I've done in the world be overshadowed by this I want to thank everyone who has reached out in support to lift me up during this difficult time now here are the comments and people don't seem to believe her it says she said a whole bunch of nothing she lost me at morals me trying to act like victim when my man caught me cheating it says i know they be lying when they use unnecessary as words to make one long as sentence mm, okay if you have a problem with your neighbor it's probably your neighbor but the whole neighborhood bro <laughs> oh, man, somebody is going in it says i understand she has a lot on her plate right now but that statement written by PR is absolutely bullish it says set a whole bunch of nothing button it says I am very open with my sexuality and expressing myself but why would this be relevant if nothing sexual inappropriate was done sounds like she almost snitched on herself a mess okay now listen a filmmaker named Sophia Allison claimed she walked away from Lizzo's documentary because the singer was air arrogant self-centered and unkind you guys she came out with a statement and she applauded the dancers for standing up and being brave and telling their story on what really happens behind the scenes working with Lizzo she says to be clear since I've spoken out I've had others privately share their very similar experiences and I have also been affirmed by people who witnessed what I went through Lizzo creates an extremely toxic and hostile working environment and undermines the work labor and authority of other black and brown women in the process notice how the documentary ended up being directed by a cis white man she means a gay white man <laughs> it says she is a narcissist bully and has built her brand off of lies I was excited to support and protect a black woman through the documentary process but quickly learned her image and message was a curated facade I stand with the dancers and anyone who has had similar experiences working with her and her team these working conditions are not okay mm. Okay, so here is someone who is backing up Sophia's claims. She says, I was part of the documentary with At Your Girl Sophia. This is all true. I had to vent to so many of my friends about it. It was such a small crew and the experience of working with Lizzo was a nightmare. Wow. 
Listen, this is getting real messy, y'all. I wonder what else is going to come out about Lizzo. Hmm. But you all leave y'all comments down below. Make sure y'all subscribe to the channel and let me know what y'all think about Lizzo being sued by three of her former dancers as well as others coming forward saying that Lizzo creates a hostile working environment. Okay. And your girl is out of here, y'all. Bye.